I just wanted to say a few words about my dad uh, before we give him a cheers from around the world. I've already received several pictures from his friends in Bahamas and Australia, um, different time zones, you know, they can't figure it out. <laughs> but what I want to say about my dad is that I think that most of you know that he was called Grumpy Sumpy. <laughs> but I also think that most of you know that that was just part of the time. I'm trying not to cry. Uh, he had a very kind heart and a deep romantic soul. Uh, I remember things like my dad teaching me to drive, but I also know it was to get him home from the Glen Eden. And as I got better from the double Z. <laughs> But he also taught me to be kind and live a simple life with gratitude. And I thank him for that. Sumpy's last few years were hard and lonely. But his friends, you guys, answered your phones and visited him. And that's what kept him going every day. He loved his friends. I talked to him on Friday night, September 11th. He called to say goodnight and that he was good. We talked every day. But he stood up out of his chair after that conversation and fell over dead. But he was free and he was happy. And he died quick, just how he would have wanted. In his home, not in a hospital. So he's at peace. I know you all knew him better than I did <laughs> and have great stories of him. So I want you to share those stories if you can tonight. We also have music. Um, but also, I have printed some copies of a book he was writing about ski patrol.